Hey everybody, welcome back to Ribbing for Ripkins. It is Corey, and we're back with another Blaster Box Battle Saturday. Getting to do the 2021 Tops Opening Day Blaster for the first time. This is my first actual opening of any of the 2021 Opening Day products. I usually don't uh, open a lot of this. I'll build the set and the little um, insert sets, but... Leave them in a binder and hopefully pass it down to some grandkids, great grandkids, somebody down down the road. Something neat for the for them to have, you know, some older sets. So that's what I do with these. But a lot of people tend to say, you know, serious collectors and grown ups should stay away from opening day. But I actually enjoy some of the newer short prints they've been putting in here, photo variations. So our top five cards will go on the board as always. Top five rookies, I'm going to use the same one as we use for the uh, Heritage. Bohm, Hayes, Pache, Mountcastle, and Mize for two points. Auto numbered cards going to be three points. A relic will be worth two, and a short print will be worth one point. So we'll see if we pull any of that stuff out of there. Um, it's, as always, we are going to be battling with Oddball cards and Clark Sports cards. They will both be linked below as well as the videos. Once they're uploaded, I will get a video linked under their channel link. So the blaster box will give you 10 packs, one extra pack, seven cards per pack. So 77 cards in a box. It should say that somewhere. There it is. And let me flip this the right way and we will get started. The design of the 2021, got Acuna, Trout, Tatis, Betts, Harper, and Luis Robert. So let's see what we can find in opening day 2021. I may end up missing something because I have seen none of this open, but starting off with John Means, who is well on his way to solidifying the all-star spot for the Orioles this year. Hot start for John Means this year. Evan White, opening day rookie card. Justin Upton. There is the mascot card of Rosie Red. So I will put that aside as well. Tejada, Brett Gardner, and Carlos Correa finishes off pack number one. Opening day mascot cards are pretty cool. That was one of my favorite parts of doing last year's set was getting the mascot cards in there. I'm hoping this year they did a better job with the names because some of them they just didn't even name last year. Found it quite disappointing. But Francisco Lindor off to a very slow start with his new contract. Mike Soroka, and we got our first insert. Stan Musial, Legends of Baseball. See, little sets like that are pretty cool, I think. Sixto Sanchez rookie card, Reese Hoskins, who's to, off to a hot start also, and Ramon Laureano, who destroyed the Orioles last week win. So O's were going for the sweep of the A's, and they... Ramon Laser Laureano ended that with a home run and a great catch in the outfield. There's a Schwarber, Yadier Molina, Kyle Seeger, and a Mark McGuire outstanding opening day insert. That's pretty cool. Shout out to Jay's openings. I'm sure he will have that card very shortly. Tyler, Tyler Stevenson and Yasmani Grandal. A couple of pretty good catchers there to end it off. It's a nice little insert with the McGuire. Still no points yet, but we got the Fernando Tatis on the back and the Nolan Arenado on the front. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. This is a nice pack. Blake Snell. There is the mascot. And they did not do it this year. They just put mascot. So the Blue Jays mascot does not have a name. Just mascot. Come on, Tops. Do better. You can do better than that. I don't know that Tariq Skubal. Good one. And there's the Tatis. I mean, I feel like the Blue Jays mascot has to have a name, even if it was just Blue Jay or Blue. 
why Tops couldn't do that. Tristan McKenzie rookie card. That's a nice one. Got another insert in this one, the Gonzalez Gold Cup. And it's the Jackie Robinson Legends of Baseball. There's something stuck to that one. Chris Sale, who should be back, I guess, another month or so. Jackie Robinson. Nice insert there. All Rise. And Colin, Mor Colin Moran. So you've seen these pictures before as they copy the pictures they use from Series 1. Wilson Contreras, upside down. Brandon Nimmo. And there is another insert of 2021 opening day athletics. Is that a Grand Slam walk-off of Matt Olson? It is ending opening day last year with a Grand Slam. I do remember that, getting the season off. Luis Patino and Nick Senzel. Still zero points. Joey Bart, I should have put him on there, but Joey Bart's a good one. The classic Craig, Craig Kimbrell with his classic starting pose. Jack Flaherty, Cattell Marte, Rangers captain. Is that the name of the mascot, Rangers captain? It is. Now it makes me want to look at the back of the Blue Jays. It's for the kids anyway, right? The Blue Jays, but their mascot continued to be Eve. Introduced in 2000, the six-foot-tall bird has a link on his official website. He just doesn't have a name. It's very interesting. Nick Madrigal, rookie card, and Mondesi, who should be back. I think very soon. They're going to get Mondesi and Bobby Witt Jr., middle of that infield is going to change and those a great start the Royals are off to they're going to go for it I have a feeling Luis Garcia Brandon Woodruff and we got a Rafi Devers parallel it is number no it's not numbered it is the date April 1st this is the parallel card but Rafael Devers pretty nice I won't keep that one Willie Mays insert Jose Barrios Nick Solak, Future Stars, and Debbie Garcia. Garcia's been mentioned in a lot of trade rumors. I really think eventually they will end up moving him. Because the Yankees are going to need some pitching. I don't think their pitching is going to hold up. Ryan Yarbrough. Max Muncy. And apparently we hit the right couple packs here. Anthony Rendon, Tyler Glass now is the blue hologram insert, April 1, 2021. Glass now off to a pretty good start. There's the Kershaw, outstanding opening day from 2013. Jose Altuve, and not a rookie that I need. So, looks like I may score zero points. This I only have two packs remaining. But still fun nonetheless. I love competing in these, but mostly I'm doing it for the cards. Cody Whitley, Victor Robles, and there is another mascot of Billy the Marlin. Thank you, Frontline Heroes. Pretty cool. JT Relamuto, Matt Chapman, Trevor Bauer. Last pack. I have no numbered cards. I have no autographs. I have no relics. And I have no short prints. Those are parallels, not short prints. There's Nate Pearson, who really could count. Brendan McKay, Future Stars. The 2021 opening day of the Nationals. This was their World Series celebration game. As you see, July 23rd. Cody Hero, Hewer, Whit Merrifield, and Byron Buxton. So that is it. I appreciate you guys watching. I scored a big fat zero, but check out the other videos and see if anybody pulled anything cool. And as always, till later next time.